Uh, this is Victory here. It's me in the workshop. But today I am in the customer's workshop. Uh, we are just checking the Cooper Mill line, which was installed about uh, two years ago. And today we got the chance to visit our domestic customer. So right now let's show you what we have. In front of us, that is one kind of the cube meal, and the machine capacity is, can be up to two inch. Right now, the machine is producing some customerized pipe. So in the first stage, we can check how it, the line works. This is the cutting saw. We call it like PLC control, cutting saw. And just follow my camera, and you will see how it works. Here is for cooling. Here is good for cooling. And this is kind of like turkey or we call it like straightening and this part is we call it like sizing sizing machine this part is also cooling pool cooling tank this place is good for forming and since this is demolized pipe, we have this kind of the material, the out. It's good for this coating. And this part of the wire is coming out from wire we do the welding. Other part. So this is the unit, and we can see a lot of rollers uh, as spare parts. Why we want to do different diameter of the pipes, and also for the square tubes. Okay, here is the accumulator. How it works. It can load the coils and the storage. And uh, after we finish the while we do this kind of the jobs, the accumulator is working. The tube mill never stop. So which means from this stage, like we call it like phase one, we need at least one operator can reload the coils to make sure the line won't stop. See? While we doing the tube mill in front. The accumulator still have enough coil. And from this side, we can see how it works. is exactly the fitting 
double head decoder. And we will load the coil material to the accumulator. And the forming machine just to keep going without any stop. So this is the line. of the tube mill and while we jointed the coil together we use this machine it's like we call it like a butt welder the butt welder can join the line or pull it out here is the butt welder it can join the coil material by the end so this is the completely line, double head, butt welding, and we call it like an accumulator. Then it goes to the forming machine, resizing machine, and a cutoff.